Hey, this is Mike with Make Weird CES 2015. I'm hanging out with Alroy from Volterra, looking at the Volterra V1. This is a circuit board printer that's uh, one of the most impressive things I've seen uh, at CES this year. Tell me all about this. So essentially, it is a oh, it is a circuit board printer that allows you to prototype electronics much faster than before. So in the past, you'd have to send out designs uh, overseas, wait for weeks to get it back. Now you just come into the office or go home, design something, press print, go for lunch, come back, and you're ready to go. Very cool. What's the um, what, what is the, uh, the the actual conductive element the, uh, on something like this? What is it made out of? So we use a silver nanoparticle conductive ink okay. in order to create the electrical traces. We also have an insulating ink that we use to mask certain areas, and that allows us to create two-layer circuits. Very cool. That's great. And this board right here, uh, I think you were telling me, this is uh, an actual, is, uh, an Arduino setup that, yep. without the components. Yep. So this is something that, uh, a quick Arduino spin-off that we did. Something like this took us maybe 10 minutes to print and a 30-minute cure time. And does it, does it require, once, once the printing is done, do you need to bake this in an oven or is it just it dry, the ink dries and it's good to go? So the great thing about our printer is it's an all-in-one solution. So after it's done printing, our print bed is actually a heated bed that will cure the ink. It thermally cures it. And the great thing about that is that it actually has a secondary use. Uh, once you're past the prototyping stage and you've got a good idea of what the circuit's going to look like, you're most likely going to do a low volume production run, 10, 20 boards, get them professionally made, throw it on the printer, it'll dispense solder paste and reflow the boards for you as well with that same heater. That's great. So the, uh, the actual paste that you're using, is this something you guys formulated? So we're working with the supplier for that. However, it's been a lot of back and forth. Uh, it's a custom formulation for our specific application and uh, for our print head, which we designed ourselves. Okay, and show me this print head, because you saw it just pops in and out. It's pretty, pretty novel. That's right. So when you purchase the printer, you're going to get three of these, one for conductive ink, one for non-conductive ink, and one for solder paste. Uh, they're super simple to use. You just slot the uh, cartridge in there, and then when you're ready to print, just snap it on. And it just pops into place. It holds it into place, and you're ready to start printing. That's great. The, uh, you guys have a Kickstarter coming up sometime soon. Yeah, so uh, we're going to be launching uh, fairly soon. Uh, the price is going to be $1,500. Um, but you know, if you get an early, you can get an early bird unit for a little bit cheaper. Um, so more details about that will be coming out in the next few weeks. And we've got some, some other uh, tricks up our sleeves that we want to share with people soon. All right, and what's the website? So it is uh, www.volterra.io. Got it, okay. This guy right here, this is a functional board that you guys printed out? Yeah, so this is just a simple uh, 555 timer circuit just to show that you know the traces are conductive, those were, uh, components were hand soldered on, um, and you know it's fully functional. Okay, and what's the uh, technical specifications? How, how precise does the, uh, does the machine print? Good question. So we print at eight mil space and trace, uh, passives down to 0603, and uh, pin to pin pitch is 0.8 millimeter. Okay, the resistance? So resistance is comparable to copper. It's, it's about an order of magnitude, uh, not as conductive, but it's still, we've done a lot of digital applications. We've done some low power, low speed analog. Everything's been fine so far. Great, great. Well, looking forward to uh, the Kickstarter. Thank Keep us so in much. the loop. Have fun here at CES, and uh, I love it. This is great. Thank you.